Wrong way drivers causing concern tonight on the east side. Neighbors say there's an alarming number of them heading the wrong way down one way streets. CBS 4's Mike Sullivan caught some of those drivers right in the act. It's really quite simple. A one way street is a one way street. That's how it is, right? Just follow the law. Yet on North Oriental, between Washington and New York, that just. They ignore the one way signs. Doesn't seem to be happening. All the way to New York or to Michigan. Chris Arsenault has lived here for 10 years. A lot of people going northbound on a southbound street. So, how prevalent is the issue, you ask? While we were down the street hoping to catch someone going the wrong way, it was at Chris's intersection. That driver ignored the signs and was heading northbound. At one point, they had to reverse as cars came toward them. We have a lot of children uh, who ride their bicycles through and through. Chris turned to his city county councilman, Zach Adamson. I'm hoping that he will be able to correct the problem. In a phone interview, Adamson tells us the issue goes beyond Oriental, adding that a lack of enforcement can lead to careless drivers. Hopefully, they're going to put up signs. At times, the signage can be blocked on Oriental, some by brush, others by bent signs. DPW reps say obstruction issues can be addressed by contacting the mayor's action line. If it's an issue of needing more signage, we can definitely take those requests and review them with our traffic team and see if more signage is appropriate. However, too many signs can also be a problem. Especially if they're repetitive, like they're saying the same kind of messages, it might contribute to visual clutter. It's clear this road needs no further distractions. In the Near East Side, I'm Mike Sullivan, CBS 4 News. Neighbors also say the North Split shutdown is only adding to the problem as more semi-truck drivers are heading down that street. DPW urges drivers to pay close attention to detour signs.